All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to Jiu Jitsu Sisterhood. I'm your host, Ashley. I'm here with Taylor Ellis. Hi. <laughs> if you guys didn't catch her, she was recently on main character Jiu Jitsu. You actually had like two super fights that day, right? I did, but nobody knew about the, the first one. What was the first one? I don't even know her name, <laughs> but <laughs> respectfully. Um, <laughs> very. Uh, just nobody knew about it. That was my original fight that I was supposed to have, but then we had the whole thing, and then I ended up having two fights. Okay. When you ended up winning both. Yeah. And how was that for you? Was that the first time you've been on a card like that? Um, main character is definitely different than the rest. So, yes, it was different in that aspect, but it was the same overall. Like the rules, you mean? Oh. Is that what you meant? Or what do you mean, like, different style? Like, the atmosphere is different. It has a whole bunch. He promotes it differently than other uh, brands, like Fight to Win. They're not, oh, she said this, she said that, da, da, da. So... Oh, so that I was see. pretty cool. <laughs> I see what you're saying. Yeah, they promoted a little bit. So as you guys can see, she got gold, double gold yeah. here in the ADCC Open. Yes, yeah, because she, I just found out she's only 17 years old. Yeah. Like, okay, so you're super young, super motivated, super into competing. Like, how did or when? I guess did you realize you were gonna do this probably professionally? Because you're so young. <laughs> um, I originally started out in somebody's like garage, and was striking like a little bit and then he ended up trying to take me down and I defended it well or something like that and so he said hey put her in jujitsu of course I'm looking at him like what is that yeah <laughs> what is jujitsu he made me buy a gear all this stuff sent me to a gym uh went to my first tournament lost didn't want to do it still and like I would say about my third tournament I got my first ever gold in my third tournament that was it that was when you knew that was the one is that that winning feeling really gets it is so how long have you been training uh, I just hit five years. Okay, so five years. So this whole garage thing was five years ago. Mm -hmm. Damn, so you were 12? <laughs> 12 years old, guys. And then the third ter that tournament that you realized you loved it, how old were you? 12. Oh, still 12. Okay. <laughs> Damn. Man, we got these, My like... My dad, like, he throws me in a whole bunch of tournaments, or he used to throw me in a whole bunch of tournaments. Now it's like, hey, I'm doing this, 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 this. And he's like, did, did you figure it out? I'm like, yeah, I got, I got it. Don't worry about me. But... There was a period where I literally competed for like two years every single weekend and, and nothing. Huh. You mean like you didn't win anything? Oh, or? no, I won it all. Or you, well, then what do you mean nothing? Uh, like, how would I explain it? No, now these type of tournaments and like main character, like the big cars, they, oh. don't, they don't affect me no more. They don't affect you anymore. Oh, you don't get nervous. Damn, bro, I still get nervous and I've been training for like 10 years. <laughs> Like, how do you deal with the nerves, then? Like, I don't know. They just kind of, like, fade, honestly. Fade After away. a while, like, every year, imagine every weekend. That's true. For two years. You're doing the same thing against different people. Like, eventually just yeah. washes away. I guess I got to do it every weekend because that's Ooh. not what I'm doing. Hey, man. It gets, it gets pricey. Oh, that, okay, that's probably the main reason I'm not doing it every weekend. <laughs> but that's awesome. You have a great support system. Clearly, like, your family, like, yeah. loves what you're doing. Like, they'll send, they'll pay all the fees, everything. That's awesome. What, what advice do you have for people your age that are, you know, competing, dealing with nerves? Because you've been already doing it so long that you're not really nervous. But, yeah. you know, like your teammates that are around you, like how do you motivate them to even get involved? Um, Especially females. Ooh, females. Yeah, right. specifically Listen, females. The community in jiu-jitsu needs to be more feminine, for sure. We need more, <laughs> like, Barbies and, like... <laughs> More girls. Dude, we just need more. Especially black people. Like, there's... Look at this line and tell me how many black people there is. None. I can tell you that right okay, now. Right none. Now I'm looking and there's none. <laughs> um, we need more. <laughs> just overall. Especially women. Yeah, that's why I do this. You know, I try, I'm trying to expose, like, the women. I'm trying to show women that it's not so scary to go it's out not. there and compete. Like, yes, we all get nervous. Eventually, the nerves fade for others. But even when you're still nervous, like, just get in there, get out there, learn something. Like, you're going to get better no matter what. It makes you feel good knowing that if a 200-pound man came and tried to attack you, that you could literally break his arm off. At least, potentially. <laughs> or just, you know. Potentially. Just, like, get up. Or at least go. get away. Yeah, yeah it, exactly. Defend yourself. It's definitely, uh, it's really good to build confidence in women and just safety overall. It really is. That's, I guess that's another reason why you love it. Mm-hmm. Is there anything else you want to say to your, your viewers, your fans? I know you got fans out there already. Uh -huh. They be harassing me. Ooh, do they? <laughs> Not harassing. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, you do have fans, dude. though. <laughs> Shout out to my, my sponsors, Carne Jerky and Level Black and Gadama and Restore and all my... 
they're all on my Instagram um, at a kind savage. And if you don't have haters, you're not doing it right. So that is that's a good statement. It's yeah. true because you know they're only gonna hate you when you're doing something they probably want to do Facts. or that they wish they could do. Facts. So don't let the haters get you guys. I know oh, I have a bunch. Oh and then show, prove them wrong. <laughs> what? Exactly. I'm like, I'm sure I have a bunch of haters out there. Yes, you should. Love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for talking to me. Of course. This was Taylor Ellis, guys. Keep an eye out for her. She's young, but she's, she's going to be out there real kicking butt. She just got her blue belt, apparently. When was that? Actually, it wasn't recent. It was like... I would say maybe six months ago. Okay, so that's still fairly recent still. So she just got her blue belt, and she did great on main character jiu-jitsu. If you guys haven't watched that stream, check it out. I think you can still play it and pay, pay for it. So thanks again. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>